like, I don't know, you guys are way too fancy for this establishment. This chick's got like shining diamonds on her neck. I almost got stabbed by a crackhead from my wallet on the way in. I'm assuming all these people are your know, private security to get the f to your car later. People, like my friends, like, oh, you do comedy, what's that like? Let me tell you what it's like. You fly from Rhode Island all the way to Seattle, and then your brother is nice enough to pick you up from Olympia, and then the next night you convince this poor bastard to drive you an hour and a half back to Seattle so you can do some amazing comedy, and then you get there and you get bumped from 7th to 25th because nobody gives a shit about you, and then you do a couple minutes of pretty poor jokes, so basically it's like a childhood dream come true. <laughs> we all end up with like sitcoms and Netflix series. It's pretty amazing. I'm glad the princess giggled at that. That's <laughs> probably the best laugh I'll get this whole miserable experience. <laughs> like a bunch of exit signs, and there's only one way to get out of this place. These things have been boarded up since actual trains were coming through here. I like how the exits are green, because if they made them red, it'd make just one more reason for this to seem like hell down here. No idea if I'm going to make it through this place. There's a lot of f***ing people that are into bondage and weird shit out here in Seattle. I might end up tied up in this place tonight with a butthole guy touching me inappropriately. <laughs> Uh, red lights on. I don't know if that means my time's almost out or Satan worship ceremony side. I really couldn't f tell you. <laughs> Sorry, this is what happens when you fly from Rhode Island and you get like 35 babies screaming and shit on the plane. And one guy didn't bathe for ever that sat right next to us. So I, I don't know, this is what happened. So I'm going to use my last like probably 10 seconds to sip this beer. <laughs> Uh, God bless America. Thanks for the time. Good luck with the protests and the anti-Trump rallies and the poetry and whatever the f*** you guys do out here. Good luck with it all. Enjoy the fun, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Brad Pierce.